Hey Collective, welcome back guys. So let's go ahead and see what's going on with your current person. We're going to see what is the overall energies in this connection. What's going on with this individual. For some of you guys, you may be in communication with this person. For others, you may not. Okay, But we're going to see what are the overall energies in this relationship. We're going to see what is this person's intentions with you and the outcome in this situation. But before we get started, guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically, and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, these readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. If the reading resonated and you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. So guys, let's go ahead and see what is going on in your current situation with this person. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians, what is the overall energy with my collective and their person here? I have the moon overall energy here. There's some type of communication that needs to come out. Somebody's holding back from a secret here. Someone's holding back from revealing something. I feel that this is ultimately causing you to have a lot of sleepless nights okay you're dealing with someone who is not telling you the truth your intuition is telling you that this person isn't telling you the truth all you're really trying to do is figure out what's going on in this situation with the seven of cups energy for some of you guys you feel that this individual may ultimately be dealing with another person they may have other options and you're wanting to know what is the real deal of this connection are they being faithful to you and if so what's going on why are they being so stagnant why are they being so cold why are they not communicating with you or opening up and telling you what they needed to tell you i feel that for some of you guys you guys went from a very beautiful abundant communicative relationship to it being very stagnant quiet and lonely with this nine of pentacles energy here i feel that your person i gotta be very honest with you guys i don't think that this person is this person isn't hiding a relationship from you. Let me be honest. They're not hiding a relationship from you. Your person is ultimately working like a dog or keeping themselves away from you because there's something that they want to surprise you with. For some of you guys, you are going to get ready to be proposed to. Okay, and you're over here thinking sideways. This person is dealing with someone else. This person is betraying me. He has all these other options. All of a sudden, you go from fucking working from nine to five to nine to ten, nine to eleven. My love, this person isn't doing anything behind your back. Five of Swords energy. I feel that your person is really, really working hard. I'm bringing in a surprise for you. Okay, Two of Cups energy. You're so me wants to show you how strong this connection really is to them. And I feel that someone this weekend will be given a ring. Somebody is going to be proposed something this weekend. Eight of Pentacles energy. This is going to bring so much forms of celebration, of commitment, of stability. It's like you feel like your person is, is turning their back to you. They don't want to talk to you. Maybe they don't want to be with you. They don't want to spend time with me. But let me tell you something. Your soulmate, the person that is truly honestly in love with you, the person that sees longevity with you, sees forever with you, is working on a big secret. And I feel that the secret that this person is working on is the fact that they're going to be getting on one knee this weekend and they will be bringing commitment to you. Okay? Three of Swords energy in the reverse. There's nothing of this situation that could potentially break your heart. You may be crying, but you're not going to be crying because of heartache. You're not. This person is not betraying you, is not backstabbing you, is not doing any of those negative things. Your person is working because there's a surprise that this person wants to bring in towards you. I got to be very honest with you guys. It don't matter, female, male, I don't care. There is going to be a conversation this weekend, Eight of Wands energy, where this connection is completely going to go from being boyfriend and girlfriend to being an engaged couple for potential marriage here. There is something about this connection being grounded this weekend. And it's going to come in out of nowhere. Someone here is going to a family barbecue. And you're wanting to talk to your person about, oh, well, what are we going to do? What are we going to wear? What are we going to take? And your person's like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Just take care of it, babe. I'll take care of it, babe. Well, you take care of it. Blah, blah, blah. 
This person is not ignoring you. This person is working for your happily ever after. This person is doing whatever it takes. Making that pinnacle to get you that rock that you desire. Okay. Some of you guys, you're just letting your mind run ragged. You're just letting your mind take control of a situation. But that isn't the case. Your person isn't running around here acting a fool. Your person has so much love for you. And I love this Three of Pentacles because it looks like a cathedral to me. Okay? This is this person working for the future. Working to have a stable connection with you. Knight of Cups energy. Someone is coming in with flowers getting on one bended knee. They want victory and success with you. There is nothing toxic about your person hiding out from you right now okay they're not wanting to end the connection they're wanting to rush in with a surprise a life-changing surprise that is going to bring in the truth of the situation why your person has been so distant and stagnant reason is is not they're not trying to cause you sadness they're not trying to end this connection they're in the midst of making a decision here and this is a life-changing decision the decision to ask you to be their wife or to be their husband don't matter no gender in tarot, guys. Please, allow your intuition to guide you in the proper energy. Don't go picking a fight with your person, okay? Your person isn't doing anything behind your back. Your person is truthfully going to get ready to surprise you this weekend. I better get some emails of who gets engaged this weekend because I want to be a bridesmaid. Someone's about to take a leap of faith this weekend, and there is happiness coming in. This, my love, this offer that this person is going to bring towards you that is going to balance every and all confusions, insecurities that you've been having this whole week is going to be your person taking that leap of faith and asking you to be their future husband or wife. Guys, there's nothing wrong about your person. They're not doing anything behind your back. On the contrary, I feel that this individual is planning a major, major surprise here for you. They're going to be coming in this weekend. I can't get that song out of my head. I'm bending me from boys to men. Somebody must have listened to that song today. But there is an energy of this connection being put in a very stable energy this week. And what are the final messages here for my collective universe? Archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. Final messages for my collective, please. I got keep an open mind. Okay. Don't allow your thoughts to run ragged. All right. This connection was always worth waiting for. This person is just doing what he or she has to do. Oh my God. God is good. Because there is going to be an engagement this weekend. Someone will be getting on bended knee this weekend and asking you to make him or her the happiest person in the planet. So guys, get it together. Stop acting crazy. Your person's working. They're trying to get your ring. Alright guys, I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. Please let me know this weekend who gets engaged. I'll be more than happy to hear from you. Alright guys, take care. Bye.